Welcome back everybody. Hope you are having a wonderful day and let's get into Baldur's Gate 3. So basically I was cleaning up my inventory, came back here uh, trying to sell that guy something and when I turned back this guy was as you can see trying to steal something from me. Observe her silently. Maybe these are just crocodile tears. Uh, ignore her theatrics. Detect thoughts. Let's do that. Guidance. And I remember I can do change this. Scuffle metal. Let's try this. The blue one. I like it. I actually don't like the blue. You see her hand in your bags and the shame in her heart. <sighs> I can't do this anymore, Batis. I'm sorry. Okay, let's go after her. Okay, I can't use it right now, which is fine. Okay, let's go here and continue. Come, Magrin, give him a chance. You get back. It's forbidden to outsiders. Corga's orders. Yep. Kick back. Force my hand and I'll show you its claws. A moment, Giona. What? Oh. I understand. You. Apparently Corga wants to see you. Go ahead. All right. Few outsiders are allowed in here. Be respectful and do not interfere. All right. Your welcome can be easily withdrawn, outsider. Respect our grove or face our claws. All right. Yeah. Fine. What is the note? I think bucket of fees. Take all. Keep away from the tough edge, she's lazy enough as it is. Alright. Wolo. Uh, let's talk to him. Ah, my good friend. You were at the gates just now, no? When the goblins came? You saw them up close? A few questions, if you please. There's okay. no overstating my interest. Alright. Fine, and there is no. Sh okay, ask your question. Glory. Now then, how would you describe that particular batch of goblins? Uh, size, nature, distinguishing qualities. You search your mind, successfully recalling various details of goblin behavior. All right. Uh, let's give an exact description. Goblins were of a rare jam-colored hue and wielded magic blowguns. A myth weaver. This man has no respect for truth. Mm -hmm. And the dragon they had marching in the rear, was it of the brass or silver variety? Witnesses failed to notice the obvious dragon. <laughs> Last question, then you'll be quite free. Did the attackers rally to the absolute when they fell upon the gates? 
did the attackers rally to the absolute when they they did, didn't they? Oh, oh, curious. Oh, curious indeed. I've interrogated one, a captive in this very camp. She reports they've abandoned their god, McLaviet, in favor of someone called the Absolute. Uh huh. The scandal. Never you mind. I'm on my way to their camp as we speak. I always knew my studies in Gukliak would come to some use. My friend, every story benefits from a dragon. <laughs> Until we meet again. Oh. Pardon me, I must prepare to travel. Good day, my friend. Okay, let me see what he has. Scroll of Lightning Bolt. The Whispering Pranis, bless mercy. When you heal a creature, you gain a plus one, plus one D4 bonus to attack rolls and saving throws for two turns. Uh, this sounds nice. Mm, we'll buy it. And then scroll of Speak with the Dead. Uh, scroll of Hold Person. Scroll of Mirror Image. Scroll of Shatter. Scroll of Mage Armor, Chromatic Orb, Thasha's Hideous Laughter, Pig's Head, uh, The Whispering Promise. I think that's fine. Let's let's take that. Where are you heading? The goblets camped nearby, of course. I've been tracing their doings with great care. Whoever this absolute they're worshipping might be, I'll be the first to write about it. Alright. Uh, let's give this to her because when you heal a creature, you gain a plus one d4 bonus to attack rolls and saving throws for two turns. I think this will be good for her because she has healing spells, right? Yes, yes, I see. And is that her with two hours or one? Alright, nothing there. Now let's get the... Antidote. Sublime a tomb. Crocus, Mugward, we'll take that, Inve, Tahan, okay I can't, okay, what is this seagull, okay I guess I shouldn't take that, Stone door. Black. By Sylvanas, the forest father, we are granted balance. Okay, let's take all this. Mugward. Anything else? No. Dagger root, I'll take it. Too fat. Okay, we'll go here. Anything else here? No. Okay, let's talk to this guy. I will do that later. Let me save it. Let me see what this does. The lever. One punch. I will come to her him again. The uh. blade of frontiers. Let's hope Will lives up to his name. 
We'll need all the help we can get. Uh, what is the other side? Oh, it's just a lift to go up, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, it's just a lift to go up. Let's let's go. Can I still stop? do that later let's go inside emerald grow kaga forest rose with claw and tooth to tear the darkness from its roots beasts chasing beasts alongside a wild woman a depiction of some local folk tale perhaps Forest rose with claw and tooth to tear the darkness from its roots. Okay. Whispering plaques, wild plague. Ooh. Please. I'm sorry. This is madness, Korga. She's just a. A what, Wrath? A thief? A poison? A threat? I will imprison the devil. And I will cast out every stranger. Whoa, 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 whoa. Girl, you mean parasite. Whoa. She eats our food, drinks our water, then steals our most holy idol in thanks. Wrath, lock her up. She remains here until the rite is complete. And keep still, devil. Tila is restless. Come, Koga. We took back the idol. Surely... Do it. Uh, let's, let's read her mind. Let's read her mind first. Uh, I don't like the color. We'll go back to this one. Nice. Let's read her mind. The detect heart is. is gone. I am first druid now. I will take control and prove my authority. And you're just gonna sacrifice the child? Let's do persuasion. Yeah, let's do that. Yeah, the friends one, right? Nice. Very well. She may go. Break your word, and my serpent uh. shall feed. Tila to me. Out, thief. My grace has its limits. It hurts. Thank you, Korga. Master Holson. Halson isn't here. Keep his name off your tongue, lest Tila pierce it. Uh, Gail. Okay, let me save. Quick save first. Uh, so we'll let me talk to Gail first. Tiring business, isn't it? All this traveling and adventuring. Why don't we take a little break? Hmm? Allow ourselves a few moments of rest. Gives me a chance to talk to you about something. Well, rather important. All right. Go We've ahead. We've been on the road together for a while now, haven't we? Hmm? Survived some perils, overcame some obstacles. 
Ever since you were kind enough to free me from that stone, I've seen you demonstrate remarkable guile and courage. The way you diffused the tension between Zevlor and Aradin. The way you got Korga to release the girl. In short, I've grown to trust you. The reason I make a point of saying this is that I've grown confident enough to tell you something I've yet to tell another living soul. Uh -huh. Except for my cat. You see, I have this condition. Very different from the parasite we share, but just as deadly. The specifics are rather personal, but suffice it to say that it is a malady I've learned to live with. Okay. Though not without some effort. What it comes down to is this. Every so often, I need to get my hands on a powerful magical item and absorb the weave inside. Yeah, what kind? Oh, staffs, tomes, cowls. The form doesn't matter, so long as it's brimming with weave. It's been days since I last consumed an artifact, and before we were abducted. It's only a matter of time before my craving returns. Mm -hmm. That is why I turn to you. I need you to help me find magic items to consume. It is vital. Dare I say it? Critical. Mm. Okay. We've already done the finding. In fact, you have one in your possession. You know for yourself how hard won such an item was, and it will be no easier when even more are required to assuage my hunger. There'll be danger involved, or great cost. Splendid. Bit of boldness will serve us well. I'm sure we won't have to look very far to find what I need. Faerun overflows with magic-infused treasure. As do our packs, as a matter of fact. Okay. We've an item already in our possession. Primed for the moment the need arises. All right. I hope I can count on you. Sure. So, let's see. Does this mean... There was something here, right? Gale can absorb this item's magic, destroying it. Uh, Gale can absorb this magic hide. Ah, oh, I don't wanna. Is there anything else? Anything you want to kill a bunch of innocents? I don't want to kill anyone, but I won't let this grow behind. Not again. Uh, I will do that later. Let me see the journal. Rescue the search for hustling. Uh, okay. Search for hustling in goblin camp. Find the Githyanki crash. We learned of Githyanki patrol in the north. So they might be able to lead us to the crash. Okay. Uh, speak with Kaga. Kaga ordered the Tifling to leave the grove. Okay, save the refugees. We managed to save Arabla. Okay. One of the adventures, the Dwarf Bran has a map leading to Nightsong. However, he was killed by the Globlins at the temple. Investigate the temple. Okay. Daughter of Darkness. We witnessed her Ridiculous. become stricken by an unjust surge of change. Okay. We recruited while a monster hunter known as the Blade of Frontiers. Yeah, he is in a mission to kill Karlaj. Okay. We spoke to Zoru, he told us he saw Gathyanki on the road to Baldur's Gate near the mountain pass in the northwest. Alright. Okay. Nice. We don't need it now, right? Alright. Let's talk to her. I know that look. You're wondering why I was in pain before. Let's just clear the air about that now. Mm-hmm. It's just an old wound that hurts me from time to time. Nothing to be concerned about. It's nothing to do with the tadpoles, at least, in case your imagination is in danger of getting away from you. It's just something I have to live with.
Quite a lot, if I'm being honest. But it always passes quickly, so I can manage. Okay. Positive. You can trust me on that. All right. <laughs> Fine. What's on your mind? Uh, we'll do that later in the camp. Wellspring plaque. Let's do this one. By claw and tooth, from root to thorn, the old oak's grove to wildlings sworn. The mural shows druids claiming the grove in the name of the old oak, Sylvanas, god of nature. All right. Let's check the logbook. Yeah, we will talk to her. Okay. Can mm. I talk to him? This will all be over. The rituals almost <laughs> All right. Nice. Thorv's fur bristles. He wants to jump, wants to bite. His eyes dart back and forth as he sniffs the air. He can't see them anymore, but he can smell them. Many, many strangers. The wolf bears his teeth. He doesn't take orders from you. He'll chase you down if not for his master. That mural. In darkest hour, a concord made, twixt harp and wild against the shade. Harp and wild? You recall stories of an alliance between druids and the harpers, but the details are vague. All right. How about this one? The towers seized, the battle done. The moonrise broke the darkest one. You recognize the mark of the dark goddess Shar on the broken helmet. This army marched in her name. So many dead. Sent to the Night Singer's embrace. Moonrise must be a reference to Shar's divine sister, Saluna. All right. What is here? Nettie. Okay, Nettie is here. But let's talk to her first. Kaga. Go on. Say it. You think I'm a monster? Well, you just tried to sacrifice a child. So... First, let's see what's her whole chicken. You have nothing for value for me. Uh, let's cozy it. Uh, um. Yes, you would say so. I know your kind. You see only villains and victims. A viper bears her fangs, defending her brood. I call her mother, you call her monster. No matter. I took back the idol of Sylvanus, and the rite is resumed. We will seal the grove, free from harm, free of intruders. The Rite of Thorns. It is the Tree Father's gift that none come to harm. When we speak the final prayer, the great vine will sprout forth. All right. The grove will be cloaked in bramble and thorn. No one enters, no one leaves. Sanctuary. 
None of this can happen while outlanders infect us. Sylvanus demands that we choke them out. Whoa, whoa, whoa. A disease of the flower must not reach the root. Pluck the petals, sever the branch if you must, but cut out the rot before it infects the whole of the wood. Teachings of Sylvanus. You must agree. No. Then you know I heed his wisdom. I protect the circle, whatever the cost. You showed great metal at the gate. The metal of a skilled sword for hire. I want you to provide your services to Zevlor. Offer to guide the Outlanders out of the grove. I'm sure they'll reward you well. Nope. They're to be gone before final prayer. If they are not, the Viper must strike. Whoa, 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 whoa. She's a child. You will do more than speak. Yet she failed. This tale That's ends but one way. With the Outlander rot cleansed, and the grove forever shrouded. Nope. I am... Why are you here? I sent you to Zevlor. I'm not doing that. They may die on the road. They will die if they stay. A clear choice. I would say. Nettie, yes. She's bumbling about somewhere. But if your treatment is meant to outlast the right, you'll be removed with the rest. What the hell is going on with her? Okay. This will all be over. The Kaga wants us to make the Tiflins leave. She fears the group cannot support the both of them and it's a... We take Grove Law seriously. By letting that child escape without consequence. We might as well have lain on the ground and let them trample us. Alright. Uh, Pinta. You again. Uh, inner Sanctum. Oh, uh, weaker... We'll take. We'll take. All right. The mugwort. Let's take that. This calls for careful. They did a number on you, didn't they? Does that hurt? Let me save this. Can I? Traps, please. Thank you. Wish I had a bag of something over there. Well. Thank you. Thank you. We need the healing. Weaker chest. That. 
Oh, that's the... Oh, death and Divinity, a godly guide. Even gods can die, huh? Let me save. Uh, Druid's Notebook. So Let's check that. Alright. Uh, let's take the mugwarts. I don't want blood on my hands. We have the right to defend our home. So that's what you want? To kill a bunch of innocents? I don't want to kill anyone. But I won't let this grove be harmed. Not again. Okay, nice. We unlocked the recipe. To make the life-saving antidote, we need to mix a bundle of mugwarts in a cauldron of the theatric uh, blessed by Sylvanas. Okay, so did we already get it? Anyway, let's just talk to her. I see you. Just give me a moment. This may be there. It's up to her now. Life or death. Now, what was it you needed? I am looking for Nettie. You found her, but I still don't know what she can do for you. Why are you asking? A tadpole. A mind flare tadpole. Yep. I... Uh, I'll do what I can. Come, follow me. I might be able to help. Nice. We need to be quick. This way. Alright. Thank you. There's something in that vessel. Take a closer look. This one had the same problem as you. Attacked us in the woods together with some goblins. Tadpole crawled out of his head soon after. Seems so. Gave Master Halson a right start. All right. It's why he joined the adventurers on their expedition. To find out what was happening. I pity you got me instead of him. He understands these things. Studied them. Still, we have options. All right. You don't have to be here for this. I will remain. I have a vested interest in the outcome. All right. <laughs> Let's see what we can do. She shifts uneasily, hesitating. Something's off. It might. But first things first. <sniffs> Tell me about your symptoms. Have you noticed anything strange happening? <sniffs> Sorry guys, if there is a little cut there. The patch one just released and I had to update it. So I can I can just start from where it begins. I'll join the I'll join the clip so you guys feel seamless experience. Yeah, let's see what you aren't telling me. Uh, what does she has for trading? Elixir of fire resistance. Scroll of animal friendship. Convince a beast not to attack you. Okay. Uh, it might. What aren't you telling? I'm telling you everything you need to know. Believe me on that. It I want to help you, but I can't unless you work with me. So, has anything unusual happened to you?
Victims can identify each other. Not that the others know their victims, of course. How do you pick up the parasite? Halson was desperate to find where all this was happening. A mind flare ship? But Master Halson was sure. Look, you've been straight with me, so I'll be straight with you. You're dangerous. If you transform here, we're all dead. She's trying to kill me, huh? But you seem like a good soul. Exactly. You deserve a chance to save yourself. This is a vial of wyvern poison. Swear to me, you'll swallow it if you feel any symptoms. All right. The thorn? Coated in a fatal toxin. <laughs> it was a last resort. In case I couldn't trust you. I don't have a cure. Only a way out. I see. I'm sorry for misleading you. But I had to be sure you weren't a threat before I told you everything. Now, do I have your word or not? I hope it doesn't come to that. But, thank you. Here. You know, I've spent my life treating folk and never once saw a mind flare infection. Then suddenly, there's dozens of you. Maybe more. Yep. Mr. Halson and I were tracking, studying, trying to figure out what the hell was going on. Because you should all be changing. There should be a small army of mind flares out there. But you're not. Weird powers aside, you seem perfectly normal. Hmm. What do you mean should be changing? Mind flares reproduce by infecting someone with their parasite. Seven gruesome days later, the victim transforms and a new mind flare is born. The thing in your skull, though, it's different to anything in our records. It's one of their worms for sure. But this one gives you powers, telepathic connections. And it doesn't turn you into one of them. Not yet, anyhow. Hmm. Could be. But there's a lot we don't know. Infected, folks like you, have been converging on an old temple of Saluna. And I've no idea why. When Master Halson heard the adventurers were heading that way, he saw a chance to get answers. Joined on the spot. Whatever he found there, he didn't make it back. Hmm. What do you want me the to do? The thing is, I've sent birds to find him. But the place is rotten with goblins. None of us can even get close. You, though, you're one of them. Technically speaking, I mean. They won't kill someone carrying their parasite. If you can find Halson and get him out of there, we can discover what he learned. And perhaps he can save your life. How's that sound? All right, so we have to I can't make any promises. This is like nothing we've seen before. Okay. But I know this for sure. Master Halson is the only one close to understanding these things. He's your best bet to survive. All right. Otherwise that vials your only option. All right. I'll Thank find Halson. It would mean everything to the group. To me. I wish I could tell you more. But only those adventurers know what happened out there. All I can say for sure is they all went to the old temple of Saluna. And Master Halson didn't make it back. Good luck out there. And if things start to go bad, remember the vial. Remember your oath. Reverend Toxie. Why is it? Let's take this I've one. Tried it and I hope to keep it that way. Better a quick draft and ceremorphosis nonetheless. Okay. Get help from healer Nettie completed. Alright. Rescue Druid Halsin. Halsin sister suggests that the parasite connected to goblin camp located. Okay, so we have to go uh, where? I don't see it. Uh, 
Uh, where are we? Okay, we, we came here, right? Okay, nobody is here, so I can... Halcyn's pipe. Is this... Halcyn's journal. Looks like Halcyn's our best bet for a cure. Time to track him down and see what he knows. Let's be optimistic and assume he's still among the living. Forget Halfin. Only a Githyanki crash holds our cure. Rune Eagle. Ooh. Rune of the Bear. What's this? Stone tablet, Mugward, uh, Mugward, Mugward, personal account, Stone tablet, Disorder of the Nerves and Mind, a treatise, orders. Okay, let's read these. Okay. Reverend Toxin, Mind Flayer, Parasites, Pippi's Man. Nice. I can sell it for 100. Wow. Ancient Scroll. Let's send all this to camp. So this one, this one, this one, this one, this one. Weather chisel set. And a godly guide will send all of this to camp. This one, this one. Okay, and we'll send all the camp supplies to the camp also. Because we need to long rest in the camp anyway, right? So, alright, so let's see Rune of the Bear. I'm not sure what this does, but I better be careful. Rune of the Bear. And how about here? Empty socket. Oh! Do I have any rune? I guess not. But no rune. Okay, I guess I have to find a rune. For me. Ooh, scroll of detect thoughts again. Nice, I got two. Let's check this one here. And there is here. There is some... Let's take all that. I'll do by type. Uh, 70. So the books are really nice to sold, I guess. Nice. All right. Need to find a way forward. Okay, so nothing here anymore, right? So let's go out.
What if they tried to steal from us? The game! We've shown them once. We take growth more seriously. By letting that child escape without consequence. We might as well have lain on the ground and let them trample us. What if Halson is... No. Don't go there. Should mind my step. Let's talk to her. Why are you here? I sent you to Zevlo. <laughs> fine, fine, fine. Let's talk to him. You did well to speak up for the girl. That snake is fickle. A tragedy. <laughs> well seen. Well spotted. We've let a snake replace our leader. What does he have? Hawk Shredder, Bone, Gold. We have the right to defend our home. So that's what you want? To kill a bunch of innocents? I don't want to kill Master anyone, Halsin. But I won't let this grow. Perhaps people. Goblin Court. Again. Perhaps dead. He'd set Mistress Korga back in line. Hold her to task. Stop this damn ritual. Okay. All will die if the rite is finished. So many more sent into a world gone mad. Would you? I would give anything to see Halsin return home. Sylvanas's blessing upon you, and my gratitude as well. Halsin is an elf with the presence of a bear. He left west with the adventurers. Okay. You won't mistake the first druid for anyone else. Uh, let's talk to this guy. Please leave. Our hospitality has limits, and they were crossed long ago. Alright. How about this guy? Mark Roy. What will the tieflings want next? Letting the hell child go was a mistake. Really? You're crazy, man. Alright, let's go back. Let me save here. Ah, I wonder if there is any way. We go there, right? What's here again? I forgot. Let me check, double check. What is here? No, that's the way we came. Ah, yeah, here. Let's check here. We will steal things. Keep your hands to yourself. You're being watched. Okay, fine. Anything? Nothing here? Kaga's chest. There is a chest behind. Can I? Can I distract him somehow? I want to see what's the ch what's in her chest. Fine. Swift as my feet Let's carry. go. Whatever. I don't know if there is a distraction. There is a storage chest here. Let's go back. Seems simple enough. So, save the first druid. The druid rat told us that first druid has Sin might be the only one capable of uh, stopping Kaga from... Okay. Save the refugee. Return to Zevlar. Let's open this up.
How do I go here? From here? Let me check. Ah, from here, right? Aha! There is something here. Let's go and check that out. There is a path. Which I didn't take before. Kill that chest. With a flick of the wrist. Nice. Let's open it up. Nice. Ooh, cap of curing. When you inspire an ally using bardic inspiration, they also regain. Oh, nice. Oh, that's good. Alfira. You all right? No, I'm moments away from a grisly death at the hands of this bloody song. I can't, nothing fits, you know? <sighs> That's the creative process for you, agony. Hmm, it can't hurt. I have her. I have an extra loot, if you want. My teacher, Lihala. She loved dancing. Okay. Her two left feet, mind. I remember waking up one night on the road and seeing her dancing beneath the stars. A huge smile on her face. Thinking of it now, my heart hurts. And my words just seem to crumble. Like ash. Wait. Words of mine will turn to ash. That's perfect. Words of mine will turn to ash. When you call the last light down Yes! Yes! Ooh
Nice. Look. Sorry. Even she is happy. <laughs> Thanks. That's the first time I've played since Lihala died. My teacher. She was playing her lute. We didn't hear the gnolls coming. There was so much blood. Still smell it. <laughs> She'd yell at me for that clunky verse and make me play till my fingers were raw. And that's exactly what I'm going to do. Finish the weeping dawn for her. The weeping dawn. I've a long way to go. But thank you. Uh, I needed this. Okay. What she give us? It's still rough, but my song is getting there. Okay, that's all. All right, fine. Thank you for the beautiful song. Let me see what's here. Are we getting outside of the Emerald Grove? Uh, who? What? Where am I? Okay, nothing here. Anything? No? Okay. What about here? Is something singing it's beautiful investigate the beach we need hear strain music on the beach where is it coming from ah is it let me check the what's here first secluded cove Nothing here. Rip cage. Okay, let's let's investigate that. We got a few things we need to do. Ooh, I can go there? Can I go there? The jump is Z, right? Let's try. Nice. Here. Nice. Hmm. What's that? Dirt mound. Nice. No use digging with my bare hands. Did I not have the shovel? Oh, I think I... How about with hammer? Don't fancy getting my hands dirty. I need a shovel. Do I have the shovel? Did I sold it? What's going on? Let me go to the camp and see. Uh, 
here, right? The traveler's chest. Don't tell me I sold it. Ah, I sold it. Damn it. Who knew that the shovel would be so useful? Now, who did I sell it to? Alright, anyway. Let's wrap things up here. We gotta do a lot of side quests and other things, right? Uh, we'll continue this in the next one. And I hope to see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.